You know what? I have two quests to release prisoners and they will become my colonists. So, my settlers. So, I think I will do that. I will do it only with Ardi because basically I think they are not hurt so no medical assistance will be needed. And I need more pawns, more colonists to pick someone from the squad because now I have just seven of them and those in captivity are useless except except the blood they give to Gwen, Josie and Artie. So I will do a little commando thing with Artie and I think it will benefit because the only last thing I have to do is to clear these mountains and it will take a couple hours. Yes, so first one, there's 13 enemies here and well, one way or another I want to do it with one go. So here first, let's take a look around, no caves, so I have to work fast. They are fleeing from their own place. <laughs> okay. Alright, whatever. Here's Rad. And she's actually good at cooking. Okay, that's cool. Because I need cook. Hardy, why you have this silly hat on? Wow. No one's here. Hi. You're free. Yeah. She joins us. Okay, that's perfect. All right, young lady, we will now deconstruct everything I can so I can so we can go back home. It will take a couple days, but it's worth it. Cuz you are worth it. She's packing. Yes, okay, everything is packed. So she's ready to go back to the colony. Ardy will be next. Ardy, another adventure. I don't have much time. Let's see what's going on here. I have no weapon, cool, awesome. Oh, do you have mortars? Uh, okay. <laughs> Excuse me, are you shooting at me? That's not nice. Chili, show me what you... Ah, Chili, you are not so... Impressive. You know what? I will just now. I will leave you. Ah, sorry, sorry. He's he's not worth it. Okay, we have another raid, but I'm gonna do it fast. Oh, he has like some weird weapon. I have this now, Doomsday Rocket Launcher. And I didn't show you, but I have also, where is it here? I have Tornado Generator. <laughs> that must be exciting. I will take those devices with me, naturally. Also, to add to my last episode, which probably will be two, ep two last episodes, I'm on my way to invent or research cleaner. 
because as you can see, I need one. So let's install it. Party. Can you just like jump here? This is the last part of the of all the mountains to check. And after Josie finishes those couple lines here, I will mark to dig all the resources that are hidden in these areas here, right? There's quite a few, I would say. And after that, this, is, this will be the final phase of everything in this season. I will mark it and Josie will dig it out. Drones will take it to the warehouse and done. And we are packing up, flying away. There was a couple conflicts between Arlene and Rad. Ampkur also got mad. And what else? And Collins, but Collins is healed. How's the cleaner bot doing? Activate him. It. He's pretty fast. Yeah, okay, so. No one has to clean from now on. All the mountains are shredded and now we know where the resources are but here we have strange looking something and Artie will deconstruct <gasps> oh okay <laughs> I kind of expected that Jojo could you whoa Artie are you have no gun? Oh, you're such a moron. Oh my goodness. Whoa. I guess Oh, people of the world, what is going on here? Put that fire at once okay now put the fire down fast so we have three new this one is dead two new people joining us but they're not really joining us they're not with us you are talented Sam Sam is great shooter can you help Sam Oh, she burns. Okay, where's this guy going? Yo. I think he's going. He's just running. You are going nowhere. Alright, so we have new people to recruit. Okay, I promise. This was the last adventure of this season. <laughs> now I'm just marking resources. We get them, we recruit new peeps, and we go out. My goodness, how many times I said that. And we have new recruit, Sam. Get your clothes and arm yourself. Sam is good at shooting animals, crafting too. So she will be direct guard. So why you wear this? No, don't wear that. She could replace Benjamin with the launcher. Look, now this is proper party. I have set this party spot here, here. And now they gathered <laughs> and have a party. There's no beer. I bought beer. You drank all. I'm gonna build you brewery in the next season. But that's cool. <laughs> Yay, Amelia joined us. And another recruit, Vitali. Welcome. Don't be so happy. You have not been picked yet. But you can join us for now and do some work. And to all that, cats join me. 
and one of them is named Chris. Siegfried. Ozzy. <laughs> Alright, join cats. I will not be taking you with me, but you can join for the ones who will be left behind. Every single pod is fueled to the max. All the resources have been extracted from all the mountains around. There's nothing else to mine. Like I told you, I will skip deep digging because it would take too much time and well i think i have enough to move one last thing left to do and that thing is picking seven humans out of 10 11 actually to create the royal squad i mentioned about it and they will be like the foundation of the empire army in Rimworld. First things first, Amelia will definitely stay with Josie, Artie and Gwen. Uh, I changed her name because Amelia is more vampiric. Yes, and she will be the royal guard because her shooting skills and passion for shooting is high. She is pretty old and as you can see the description speaks for itself. Female ancient soldier of the Empire. <laughs> You just have to take her with us. I mean, I will have to take her with the vampires. Next in line is Collins, who's been with Josie, Artie and Gwen since the beginning. He was the first human recruited and fed on. <laughs> and now he's sick of some food poisoning. But he w he's going definitely with us. Also, high skills. Very versatile, I would say. He has his times of grief and and bad mood but it's all to live with arlene our gardener royal gardener <laughs> even though her skills uh, are not so high she has no passion for it but well we'll see maybe she will find some passion for it but she was good gardener and doctor nurse for all the people that was in need so she's coming with us next in line Rad. She's not so mm, long with us, but in the team, but very helpful. And yeah, well, skills speaks for itself. It's a good start for someone to the royal squad. Bowman, next in line. High skills, some passion for construction. Very helpful in building things. So Ardy is not alone. Also in research. That's nice. Okay, so she's going with us. I will change her name for more vampiric one. Now two more. Ampkur, Val, Vitali, Bibi. Well, Bibi will stay here because she lacks in skills. Although she's great gardener and she was helpful nurse, her behavior is like she wants to stay and she seems like she doesn't fit. But of course, I'm leaving her in this kingdom here, so good luck. But Ampkur, which will have his name changed, is going with us for sure. Crafter, great researcher, okay, that's enough for a start. Now Val is silent, he's not like on the front of the action, but he can be pretty good shooter, researcher. And he, he's fast learner also. And you know, I had no problems with him. No breakdowns, no like strange behavior, no strange actions. So I'm taking him. This will be my ultimate squad. Josie, Artie, Gwen, Amelia, Collins, Arlene, Bowman, Ampkur, Val, Valentine. Valentine actually and Rad. Now it's time to pack up all the stuff. See J Josie is doing all the other things. So let me pack up. I have crazy amount of steel over 12,000 silver components a lot. It all goes with me except of course wood and well I will take some cloth with me some leather but not all. All the bricks blocks will stay all the food will stay it's been great adventure and think that 
it's just a start because it's end of season one. Like I said many times, season two will contain more mods, more complicated gameplay, new map, new save, the royal squad, of course, with the three vampires, and it will be even more fun than it was. This was just like the season one was just like the introduction to the story and uh, all the fun will be in season two and three. Season two will be about Josie and her squad, royal squad, getting out of this planet. And season three will be, if you know the story, if you follow the story, you know that Josie wants to get back with Artie and Gwen. They want to get back to her home planet and, well, rule there. Okay, they're packing. I'm leaving BB in charge here. She will decide what to do with Shadow and Bales. And it's her kingdom now. Although Josie and Arya and Gwen and the royal squad are not leaving the planet yet. But, well, BB, it's now your home. Good luck. Yes, guys. Pack it up. Pack it in. And let the season 2 begin. <laughs> in the season 2 except new mods, I will customize the royal squad. They will have custom clothes, custom colors. There will be multiple colonies to manage. There will be like center colony, which will be Josie's uh, mansion or actually fortress. Mansion will be built when we get back to the, to the home world. And let me spoil you with a couple mods. So once again, these are and will be the mods I was using in the season one and will be using in season two and three to give visual credit to the authors of those mods. You guys are great. The mods are fantastic and make the game so, so, so much richer. Psychology mod. Awesome. This is just must have. I just, well, this is just the best. <laughs> I can just glorify every single mod. Although I didn't check this one, prosthetics, but it will have its use in season two, I promise. Doors extended, also nice, but I didn't check it. I didn't show it. Fish industry, very innovative mod. Wall lights, awesome. This will be more shown in season two as well. This is one of those mods that save the game <laughs> because you can see hats or you can pick to not see the hats. For me, it's important. Hospitality will be more shown uh, in the next season, but also helped a lot in this season. More furniture, use that. Very good mod, great. This one is really nice small little but nice more floors we'll be using them also in season two more very helpful speeding up holding even when you have drones well this i was talking about and this is awesome mod awesome and to these mods which were shown and will be shown in the next season i will add in season two plasteel surgery which is the base mod for barber pods which i will be using because like i told you there will be custom made royal squad die i was talking about it all kinds of new hairstyles which are amazing here here and here right to all that hygiene <laughs> because well, <laughs> it's super fun. Also, industrial age, adding some cool items and, you know, giving this steampunkish industrial vampire style to the game, which I like very much. And I will try this one. I hope it's cool. So we will see. I have high hopes for this mod. And in season three, little sneak peek. Okay, enough. And thank you very much for watching, thank you for all the likes, thumbs up, and subscriptions. Thank you Gwen for inspiring story, which led 
to this playthrough and gave me ideas for all the three seasons. And I really, really hope to see you in season two because I'm curious what's going to happen in season two. And the season three will be, like I, like I said many times, let me tell you this, that the situation in season three, the situation when Royal Squad will be attacked by zombies and paladins healing zombies and each other equipped with shotguns, that will be normal thing. Also, Josie's story is not only limited to RimWorld game, if you want to see Josie in other games and Josie the Vampire in other games, well, thank you very much again for watching, see you in season 2 or in other videos, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, ignition, start, bye.